Hi there, I am Mimit Alkoş. In this video, we will solve one problem in chapter 8. On a flat road, my car, a 1050 kg Toyota Yaris, can reach 108 km per hour in 14 seconds if it begins from rest. If the acceleration of Yaris is assumed to be constant, find the instantaneous power supplied by the engine when its speed is 108 km per hour. Calculate also the average power supplied by during 14 seconds. Instantaneous power is the first time derivative of the work done by a constant force F during displacement R. Since it is constant, we have F dot dr over dt. And dr over dt is the velocity of the car. Therefore, the instantaneous power becomes f dot v. In our example, the force acting on the body due to the engine is parallel to the velocity that is parallel to the distance. As a result, the instantaneous power is calculated by the formula f times v. From the Newton's second law, we have f equals m times a. Since this is an example of one-dimensional motion, we can find the final speed by this formula. The initial speed v0 is 0, so a becomes v over t. If we rearrange the formula, we obtain m times v squared over t. Put the numerical values into this equation. Therefore, we obtain approximately 67,500 watts. Or 67.5 kilowatts. Average power has the formula work over time. By the kinetic energy work theorem, we have delta k over t. Or k2 minus k1 over t. The initial speed is zero, so is the initial kinetic energy. So we obtain k2 over t. We use the formula 1 over 2 times m times v squared then we obtain the average power as m times v squared over 2t. As you see, it is one half the instantaneous power. We substitute the numerical values. Finally, we obtain the average power as 33,750 watts. Or in three significant figures, it is approximately 33.8 kilowatts. Okay, this result brings us to the end of the discussion of this problem. Thank you for your attention. See you in the next video.